Toxic people can be found everywhere in this society. Sometimes toxic people can be found in our family. Maybe they can be found in our neighborhood. Maybe we can find them as our friends. So in one way or another, we have to deal with these people. And also we have that intention that we should not get hurt ourselves and also we should not hurt others. So we need to find a way to deal with these people. Remember this well. If I do not accept anything that you have given, then everything that you gave to me belongs to you, then you should feel it. Normally, when people yelling at us, we try to talk to them back. We try to prove them wrong or right. We try to control them with our rude and harsh words. If you treat with anger to the people who is treating you with anger, if you give the same thing, if you become angry, that means you are sharing their treats. Remember, whenever you are in such situations, whenever you face toxic people, whenever people around you are angry, what you have to do? The first thing that you have to do is put on a positive smile to your face. Never show your sad or angry face to them. If you show that, that means you are providing what they want because they are coming to you expecting to hurt you. If you show them that you have been hurt, then you're unsuccessful. You provide them what they wanted. So never show your angry or sad face to them. Put on a smile. Be a positive person. Be a bigger person than him. Because when one person becomes angry, he becomes mentally weak. Remember, mentally weak people express their anger easily. The reason why they are expressing their anger is because they don't have a strong mentality. So you need to be the bigger guy. To be the bigger guy, you have to be positive, you have to smile, and you have to be motivated with virtues and morals. Be the best version of yourself. Don't try to talk to them back. That is the first thing. And also, you have to listen to what they tell, what they speak. Set apart and leave behind the person. Don't care about the person. Care about what they say. Sometimes they may be yelling at you because of a mistake that they think that you have done, but in reality, sometimes you haven't done it. So what you have to do? You have to listen to that and understand what they say. Give a big attention to what they say. If they complain you about a mistake or something else, then you have to think, is that mistake prevails in my life? Is that mistake is inside my life? Have I done that mistake, really? If you have done some mistake and if that is the reason that they are yelling at you, then you have to correct your mistake. But never show the face of anger or sadness, then you have to correct it. If you haven't done any mistake, and still if they are complaining you, then don't try to prove them wrong. Because each and every time you try to prove them wrong, they may be understanding it in a wrong way. Because when our mind gets deluded or when our mind is covered by anger, normally, an angry man shuts his eyes and ears, and he opens his mouth.